need now to evolve? What do new artists need to be aware of? And what does the community just have an understanding in how we come together? Because there's certain events like this, and it's, it's getting bigger and bigger platforms. It's being recognized for what it is as a, as a, a social movement and as a, as a means of allowing people to access our community. With Afroflux, you, you, the integrity of your company is the vision and the artist you're bringing and the content and discussions you're having is the evolution of people. It's allowing that social empathy, it's allowing yourself to open your heart chakra and say, I'm not, I'm not thinking with, with thoughts, I'm thinking with images and vibrations and energies. So that's what we're connected to, we're transcending barriers and trends and that, and the whole discussion, you know what I mean? You're a platform for this, and you brought three goddesses from different, from different dynasties of, of, of ethnicity, and they are coming with their upbringing here, but they're still spirit, spirited and empowered by their, their, their desire to, to challenge, to go deeper, to, to, to discover themselves in their craft. That in itself is so deeply inspiring, it, it, it's creating a new legacy for what is hip hop. So now, we need these checkpoints. We need the new gladiators, the new uh, Olympiads of hip hop to stand up, and we need to see them as our champions and say, yo, that's who I respect, that's who, I, that's who I'm working towards, that's who I envision, that's who I'm connecting to. And now, that is this ecosystem that's moving, and I'm a blessing to you, brother, for your doing.